my own philosophy is uh, I hate bye weeks because you lose the speed of the game, the tempo, and it takes you a while to get the rhythm back. And I think it took us 30 minutes to get our whole rhythm back, particularly on offense. The defense sort of found theirs early and they were okay. And luckily for us, they kept us in the game for a while. And it seemed like at halftime, the offense decided that uh, they figured out what they could do against Falpo and they went and did it. I think they came out with a lot of intensity. You know, it was their homecoming. Um, and it took us a, like a quarter to get going, which, which can't happen in the future. We need to bring it on four quarters, um, put together four quarters of offense, which we haven't done all season yet. But then we picked it up the last three quarters and we really showed who the dominant team was. And uh, I think with practices, if they're going like this, then I think we'll have a good shot. It's very nice when you have a tight end who can get open and catch the ball and make big plays, and he's a good blocker on top of it. So we uh, we feel comfortable even flexing him out like a receiver and letting him work one-on-one. -on -one. He has good size about him and he good speed for a boy his size, and so uh, it's, it's, it's a very good weapon, and I, I think that we've been barren around here for a few years having that type of tight end. We sort of tailor make everything for the offense that we're playing or for the people we're playing. Like, like last week, we, we knew what we wanted not to happen to us versus Valpo. We have the same feeling about Maris. We know Maris is a, they're a big play team, and, uh, and they have been against us, and we're just hoping to slow that big play stuff down this week. Playing the full 60 minutes, you know, uh, two years ago at homecoming, we won uh, with a field goal in the last 10 seconds, I think. Last year, I believe we uh, threw a touchdown pass with just a minute or so, a minute over or under to beat them up there. It's always a very, very hard fought game. They're very talented, well coached, big bunch of guys. Keys to winning, I'd say our offense needs to come out firing on all cylinders and the defense just needs to do what they've been doing all year. You know, get turnovers for us and we're going to capitalize off those turnovers.